Tomatoes are my favourite fruit, but also the world's and, well, my grandparents too, who introduced me to growing my own. And here, I'm about 10 years old, growing tomatoes in my back garden for the first time. So, if you want to grow tomatoes, but in particular in the UK, then this film is for you. As usual, tomatoes most likely from Holland or Spain, Alicante. But, in particular, 80% of British tomatoes are actually imported. And these tomatoes I'd like to call plastic. These are picked green to ripen in transit, like what the f And backing up, there are two main classes of tomatoes. The first grow into small bushes, and these you can leave them alone, well as long as you water them and they will do very well, with very low maintenance and skill level required. These smaller plants tend to have smaller fruit. This variety is called Tumbling Tom Red and it grows great in a hanging basket, cascading down beautifully. Officially speaking, these tomatoes are called determinate. They have numerous side shoots which terminate in clusters of flowers. Alicante. A tall, reliable growing tomato variety, but one which requires a bit more maintenance and skill. For instance, you need to support this plant with sticks when it grows, these tall growing tomatoes are the class of tomatoes that are grown commercially in huge greenhouses. Getting quite hungry at the moment. Officially speaking, this class of tomatoes is called indeterminate. They grow indefinitely tall until you pinch the top shoot off. With bigger plants, disease is very common, with blight being the main problem. I mean, the British weather, come on. But also there's a third, and that's basically an in-between of both of them. And that's mainly the beefsteak varieties. Beefsteak varieties are my favourite, and as the name suggests, they're very fleshy. And for me, are a vegan substitute for meat, but in particular, ham. But the main problem growing these in the UK is that because of the large fruit, they don't really get time to ripen in our growing season. With beefsteaks, it's so important to train them with sticks, otherwise the size of the tomatoes can literally break the plant. For me, investing in a small <laughs> greenhouse was a great decision. At college, this was my hobby, growing tomatoes in the greenhouse on the allotment. Guys, this was by far the best DIY project to date. But there was one problem for the allotment association that my greenhouse was twice the size that is permitted. Guys, I almost cried having, having to break it. The winning kind of tomato plant has to have cherry tomatoes, which just ripen really quick. It's got to be a bush plant, so it's easily manageable and of course easy to grow because not all of us want to be spending every spare second gardening. If it's your first time growing tomatoes, then this will be a great plant. So let me know guys, have you grown tomatoes before? And if so, what variety would you suggest? Let me know down in the comments. Stick a like guys if this video helped you. And why not sub for more? And now it's time to sow some more seeds with recycled rubbish. If you click the link, you can check it out.